the fourth Sunday in Easter. Year C. From the Gospel according to John. The works that I do in my Father's name testify to me. In the name of that same Father, who with the Son and the Holy Spirit lives and reigns, now and forever. Amen. It's curious just how much clothing is held up in front of us in our readings for this Good Shepherd Sunday. When we think of shepherding and the creation of garments out of wool as a metaphor for God's redemption and care for us, we should be speaking of not one, but layers upon layers of processes that interweave the not always complementary efforts of both shepherd and sheep. Jesus speaks of calling, leading, and guarding the sheep. The blood of Jesus washes clean the robes of those who have come out of the great ordeal. In Jewish culture, the blood of an animal is its life. The elders wash their robes, therefore, not just in the blood, but in the life of the lamb. Jesus calls us to soak up his life into our own so that there is no aspect of our own ordeal, either in life or in death, that has not been touched by God. The mourners hold up the garments that Dorcas had made for them, testifying to the loving care with which she had clothed their nakedness, having soaked up the image of God who clothed the nakedness of our first parents. Peter's raising her to life again indicates that our lives are even more precious to God than the products of our works. We do not live as though we were mere mannequins to display the garments we have washed in the blood of the Lamb. Rather, we live sheltered from the storm and from the scorching heat, fed and watered and wiped clean from every tear, because we are precious to God and worthy of care. Having then been raised to newness of life in baptism as a testimony to that life to come, let us likewise worship our God and in his name let us tend to one another as each of us has been given experience and skill to do as an ongoing testimony to the love God has shown to us and to our neighbor. In the name of that same God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs>